All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Kobayashi's Dragon Maid Season 2, Episode 10. The last episode was amazing. Beautiful fight between Elmer and um, Toru, and it was just a spectacular episode all around. And I'm definitely looking forward to these last few episodes of the season now. Um, I, I think the, the season's a 12 episode, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, definitely looking forward to it, and that is that, guys. Anyway, guys, like the video if you like the video, and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into this episode right now. Ooh, Kana. Kana's dragon. <laughs> what did she say? Why did she call Kobe? She's a butt face. Well, Kana's dragon form is so pretty. She's in New York. What the hell? Well, this is going to be quite interesting of an episode. <laughs> Kana goes to New York. She has no idea. Can she just not like comprehend languages or something? God, hearing Eng English is so weird in anime. Oh, so she's translated it. <laughs> this is already gonna, it's gonna be such a fun episode, I can already tell. <laughs> Holy shit, Kana! <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. <laughs> Kana just wants to play whenever. She looks like, she's literally an animal. Oh, <laughs> does she have money? <laughs> a black card. Oh my god. Just go and withdraw some cash. She's probably richer than Saikawa though. <laughs> Bro, that looks like the Tipton Hotel from Sweet Love. Is it the Tipton Hotel? <laughs> this is going to be Kana's best day out ever. <laughs> Look at her! <laughs> Oh, she must be worried about Kana. Oh no. She's kind of just venting about herself. Kana, stop them! Kana! Go, Kana, go! Come on! Oh, Kana's angry. <laughs> oh no, it's Aaron Yeager. Oh, she's coming. Oh, she's coming. Oh, 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 oh my god. She's just busting in in dragon form. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. <laughs> it's so nice that she gets to show her a dragon form. And yeah, the friends back home have never seen it. <laughs> so probably past. So probably that way. Hmm, yeah, probably that way. It's only a different state. I want to know what the argument between Kobayashi and Kana was about. I bet it was something really stupid. I'll give you my address. It's in Japan. But it's rich, you're fine. Oh, she's been waiting up for her. A good mom. Oh, Kobe actually was going to apologize too. <laughs> That's adorable. <laughs> Toru was there. No fucking way did I not notice that. No way. I have to go back in the episode. Hang on. Oh my god, she was right there. I don't believe it. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh my god, how did I not notice that? I can't believe there were like three scenes Kobayashi uh, Toru was in, but I didn't notice them. My god. No, <laughs> she's going to sleep. <laughs> I love how little kids grab juice and that. It's sort of like. <laughs> yeah. Love it. Atu. Atu. Oh no! Can <laughs> <laughs> oh, Kana. 
She plugged it into her tail. That's so cute. Mini tomato. Mini tomato. That's so cute. <laughs> so many things kind of says so cute. The voice actor is so good at playing her. Oh, is it from uh, American Girl? Oh, some, some juicy ass watermelon. These two are adorable together. Oh my god. Actually, like a mother and daughter. Yeah, that's why it's called a manhole. <laughs> I love that. Just, I love this episode. Just teaching Kana stuff. It's great. It's wholesome for the. It's good for the heart. There's <laughs> like documents in every manhole in the sea. Oh. Even dragons get brain freeze. <laughs> what? That's literally what I just said. What the hell? He's the talk of the town. What is this? Where did this rain come from? God damn. It's like UK weather. Rain in the summer smells so good though. It's great. <laughs> this show is so random. Good job, Kana. You saved the ladybug. Oh. <laughs> Take a shot every time Kana says, oh. God, I love the relationship between all these guys. Like a proper family. Alright, so that was Kobayashi's Made Dragon, Season 2, Episode 10. That was a really nice episode. Just like the last episode was kind of a Elma-focused episode, this episode was pretty much fully focused around um, Kana, which was really nice. Uh, I'm loving these kind of individual episodes. Maybe the next one will be about Toru or Kobayashi. I don't know, but uh, I think it's it's really nice. It's, all the moments are super, super random, but it's so wholesome. And it just, I like how the the episodes go, where it's just like, it's most of the time it's one, uh, two to three stories in one. Um, but these one-off episodes where it's just fully about, you know, kind of the focus is just one character mostly. Um, it's just really nice, and I really enjoyed this kind of side quest, in a sense, for Kana this episode. Her going all the way to New York, meeting a new character, hopefully will be kind of recurring on the show. That would be fun for her. Uh, and then just the wholesome kind of full day off for uh, Kobayashi, and she gets to spend time with Kana, just like a mom. Uh, it was just really cute, and I loved every every moment of it. It was definitely a great episode. Um, but yeah, uh, overall, nothing really else to say other than that. Um, definitely looking forward to the next episodes, and that is that, guys. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did, and I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice day, and peace out.